peel mask it's supposed to like peel your skin off like throughout the next few days because four to seven days it peels off naturally so i'm excited to try it i've had this for like a month now so we're gonna try it today for our spa day
check out my tripod to do this. Smells good, it smells like lavender, so that's fun. Take this. I feel like butt care is something that a lot of people forget to do. I forget to do it. I didn't do my nails, but they still are okay. Um, it feels pretty slimy. <sighs> and just to just rinse with warm water, so I'm gonna do that. Shown my feet this much on a video. Okay, you're not gonna see much of it happen today because it's supposed to take four to seven days. So if um, before I upload this video, I have more like, results. I show I uh, will show you, but I do run, so I tend to get a lot of blisters on my feet. So hopefully this will make it more soft. It does feel softer. I do feel softer. I do like try to moisturize every time I take a bath. But there you go. Feet care all done. Okay, so the last thing I have for today is a face mask. I got a set of face masks. Let me. <laughs> okay, so I got these sets of face masks for Christmas. So I'm gonna try to do one today. Um, so I'm gonna wash my face and then do the mask. So keeping with our lavender thing, you know, the lavender peel off. <laughs> foot. <laughs> the lavender foot mask, the lavender bath and bath, bath bomb. We're gonna do a lavender uh, mud mask. So first things first, we're going to, I think I have to wash my face first. I can't put my hair in a ponytail now. Look, 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 look. It grew. I have ponytail hair now. So y'all know the drill. We're doing CeraVe face soap. Something I've been doing in the morning to that night is giving myself a facial massage when I'm putting on my soap, just to help with any poofiness, especially in the mornings after my runs. Like I feel like it really just helps, and it feels really good. So, well, this kind of just absorbs a little into my skin I'm gonna floss because dental care is just as important as anything else look at me incorporating dental care and foot care and whatnot um, dental uh, flossing actually has become part of my habits now so I'm happy you know for it being kind of late and everything I have a sudden burst of energy that I don't know where it's coming from Teeth have been flossed. I rinse my face now to pat it dry. So I'm gonna let my face completely dry. While I do that, I'm gonna brush my teeth. I wish I had um eye patches that would have been fun to use today um i'm gonna let that fully dry really like how my nails came out they're so cute they're so simple minimal natural with like a pinkish kind of tone to it i really like it so we're gonna go ahead and put this mask on it is a detoxifying and relaxed really a detoxifying and relaxing mud mask to de-stress and pamper the skin. The natural scent of lavender will infuse your senses, leaving you feeling refreshed and relaxed. Hopefully, I don't break out because <laughs> I don't really wear scents on on me in general. I try to avoid it as much as possible. It smells good. I love lavender stuff. Like love, love lavender stuff. I had everything lavender when I was in college. It was just really nice. Oh, and it feels really nice actually. Because like, I have really bad migraines, that's why I have the day piercing because it's supposed to go through one of like, pressure, like one of the pressure points that helps like, ease the pain of migraines. So I grew up with really bad migraines. And aside from that, like I heard that lavender really helped with migraines. So I had lavender oil growing up. And I just really grew to love lavender, especially in college. I went through like a lavender phase. Everything I own was lavender scented. 
uh, ooh, 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 ooh. it burns right here on my nose area where it's dry. Okay, word of advice, don't put um, stuff on dry areas. Um, oh, jeez. Ooh, it burns there. Okay. Okay, it went away now. I'm just gonna make sure I moisturize there very well. But yeah, I was so into lavender that at the time I really wanted to get a lavender tattoo and I was gonna get it on my trip to New Orleans. But then 2020 happened and we had to cancel the trip to New Orleans and we didn't go again until last year, 2022. And then by then I felt like I still was going through the lavender phase but not like it just didn't feel right to get the tattoo anymore because that was more like a college tattoo like it would have represented a phase that i went through when in college and that's besides the point ghost face i said to leave it on for 15 minutes so i'm gonna leave it on for or 15 minutes or until it dry so i'm gonna leave it on for that much time and put on some aquaphor yeah, because I don't know about you, but every time I wear a face mask, my lips tend to chap for some reason. So, we're going to let this dry. I will be back in 15 minutes to finish my spa day. Okay, for the most part, it's dry except in areas where I put a lot of like here. But everywhere else, like it's dry. So, I'm just going to rinse now because within those past few minutes, it's like I conjured a migraine because my head started hurting. <laughs> I'm gonna rinse this off now. I'll tell you this, that mask was pretty nice. It felt very refreshing. Like it just felt really cool on my face. So I'm gonna use my rose water toner. So just pop that in. I don't remember when was the last time I did a night skincare routine, but in case I haven't done it in a while, I switched my vitamin C to the mornings and I'm using a retinol serum instead at night. So I used two pumps of that. It's from Trader Joe's, it's a sort of cheap one. Like it's it's cheap for right now. I want to do more research to get like a better quality one, but at least for now, it works. You know, it's preventative care. It's not like I need it right now. Take out my quartz roller and just smooth it in there. Now I'm going with my vegan collagen eye mask or eye cream. Again, this is more preventative care rather than like doing anything. I don't know if I can tell the difference. I feel like these kind of products you can tell over time, like a long period of time. So I just have to kind of trust that they're working. <laughs> you know what I realized? I'm always wearing this sweater, blue neck, when I'm recording. And I sort of have other clothes, but this is one of my favorite. And literally all the clothes that I have in my closet is stuff that I'm always wearing on repeat. So I'm not ashamed to admit that I'm an outdoor repeater here. My all-time favorite, I think they changed the formula, but it still works. It's the all the feel facial oil uh, from e.l.f. and I absolutely adore this one. Oh, it feels so clean, like so, so clean. <laughs> my last step is Aquaphor on my lips. And the last thing I do before going to bed that will be part of my little spa day today is use my cuticle oil for my nails, especially today that I did my nails. Normally, I do my nails in like a two-day part because it took me about like two hours and a half to do my nails and I usually clean my cuticles and all of that and like put on the dip powder one day and then the next day do any nail art. So just putting it all on my cuticle and massaging it in. I still can't get over how nice they are. They look so clean, like just clean and minimal. And I like that. Normally I uh, have my nails much longer, but as I swear every time I say I'm gonna sit down and record my nail care routine, one of them breaks. And like I had them um, bare for like four days and it was fine and literally yesterday one broke. So and the oil I use is the Kyusho Natural Luxury Spa Kiriko Re Revitalizing Oil. The milk and honey one. It smells really good. 
I really like it. It's a little pricey, but I really like it. I've had it for ever since I started doing my nails actually, so it's been a while now. And it's lasted me a while, so it's nice. But yeah, that's it. That's all I have. It was a pretty nice, relaxing day, sort of relaxing. My nails always stress me out. But other than that, like it felt nice. I like to pamper myself. The foot mask was new so that's very exciting to see how it will develop anyway that's it i'm tired i have a headache i want to go back to reading anna karina and i want to go to sleep so i will end this video here thank y'all so much for watching have a beautiful night and i'll see y'all next time bye